that's kind of been a thing since I was a freshman. Mr. Norby himself is really big on community outreach and Garden City is a really giving community. They're always willing to help the high school out. So um, something super cool um, about this school is that we have a our life skills class. Um, they are the Buffalo Coffee Shop. So they're, you know, the students um, that take the life skills class and they, every day they go around on carts and they make um, hot chocolate, Rice Krispies, you know, coffee, just uh -huh. simple snacks and they go around and they sell to the students every day. And what they do with their profit is um, they donate a good chunk of their profit. They donated ten thousand dollars this mm -hmm. year to charities and I mean I think that right. no other school really right. has an organization like that that gives them a chance to interact with students and give back to the community. And yes. teachers do go kind of help. Yeah, them. student mm -hmm. student council and the Buffalo Coffee Shop kind of go hand in hand like um, to add on to the everyday selling they have uh, pancake days where you know we make the pancakes and then they go around and sell them or burrito days where we make the burritos and they go around and sell them and then that um, that money will go to either recently we had a student diagnosed with leukemia so we had a burrito we had a pancake day for her and then all the proceeds went to her family to pay for medical bills and um, yeah, they help Stu, Stu go out a lot. I did a, an event called Empty Bowls uh -huh. to raise money for um, food pantry for kids to have, the kids that don't have food on the weekends to have food. And they matched my donate, they matched the, um, how much money the event raised, so that was super nice. Matched the Buffalo it. Coffee Shop matched. And that was a partnership with Finney County United Way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'd say that would be my biggest community service event that I've ever done.